Ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Quinkster, and welcome back to a, another mini kit guide and level challenges guide for Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. And we're taking on the second level in Attack of the Clones today, titled The Hunt for Django. So we have three challenges to do do an alien roll. I completely mispronounced that. Charged up and flying is for droids. So I'm going to say it right now so I don't forget later. Uh, if you want to use it, there are quick links in the description box below that you can use to skip ahead to the first, second, or third challenge or any of the five minicons that we will be collecting today. So, without further ado, let's get started with the hunt for Django. We have five minicons, three challenges, true Jedi. Let's get to it. And A. Okay, so, uh... I just destroyed a bit of stuff first to get some studs for True Jedi, but the first minikit is going to be right as you pass by here and get kind of your system shocked. You're going to go a little bit up. All right, just dodge that missile, but you're going to go a little bit up, and looky here, right around the corner, is your first minikit. Well, it's pretty easy. It's right off the bat. Now, uh, so we're going to speed a bit ahead here. So your second minica is going to be like these uh, these five satellites uh, that you do have to destroy. So let's go ahead and get those five. So this is going to be number three right here. Boom. And this one right here, it's kind of hiding right here. Ado. That'll be number four. And number five, we're going to do a quick edit to. So it's, a, so it's like a bit of ways to the right, but we got there eventually. But, uh, anyway, since there's no map, uh, I, I mean, these satellites are pretty big. All you have to do is just search around the map for them. And there we go. That will be number five out of five in, our, in your second mini kit. So, third mini kit should be right over here, right as you pass that uh, uh, that third and fourth satellite that I blew up. Should be mini kit number three, and then mini kit number four is right here, over here. This thing that looks like a mini kit satellite, but we were able to collect it. By the way, uh, the collectibles detector is really useful for this uh, for this level. So, now we're going to take on the level challenge, flying is for droids, and you just have to go through this entire asteroid without crashing into it. So my advice is to just take it super slow. Now of course you're playing the slave one, which probably isn't the best tool, because it's kind of very elongated, which I probably should have chosen an X-Wing or something like that, but it is what it is. But basically just take it slowly and you should be able to get it done, no problemo. And there we go, we got out. Alright, and then for our fifth and final minikit, we're actually going to turn back into this. We're going to go full speed now. I crashed several times, as you can see. And the fifth minikit is actually inside the asteroid, and it is right over here. Alright, it is just under this rock. Here it is, right over here. Sweet. Now, uh, we're going to go back and do a rerun for the final two challenges because it's just going to be way easier that way to get it done if we uh, restart the level. So, without further ado, I'm going to do a quick edit and we'll restart the level. Okay, so uh, the second challenge is to do an alien roll. So, basically, you just have to dodge these incoming missiles at you and you have to do them three times. So I'm just going to show you each of the three times till we... Ooh, whoa, okay, that was a close one. Alright, and then we just got to dodge those. There we go, and that is a challenge completed. Now, the next challenge we're doing is the charge up challenge. And, well, well I'm not going to show how to do it. It's really easy. Just avoid the... Uh, the seismic blast charges and you'll get it. But, that's a level complete and we get true Jedi as well. So we got a bunch of studs out of time. So you have over 150,000 studs. That is very useful. We're over 2 million in our studs now. So that is a very, very good thing. Now we completed all three of the level challenges, which is a very good thing. 
and mini kits we got all five of them which gets us Django's starship in its micro form so it'll be very cool to fly that around the hub world or the planets as they are and with that being said that's gonna be it for this mini kit guide and level challenges guide so that being said I'll see you guys later today for another one bye bye